is Diddy King. I'm back today with another video. I appreciate you for tuning into the channel. If you are not subscribed, make sure you smash the subscribe button because on this channel, I teach you how to make money with a lot of different gig apps. And guess what? I have one for the history books for you guys today, baby. You guys will not believe what happened. So, we are going to be using an app that I use called Bungie. B-U-N-G-I-I. -I. If you want to sign up for Bungie, click the link in the description. There's a link in the description. And the referral code is WSSV1. Again, click the link in the description. And the referral code is WSSV1. Go out there and get the job done. Now, we have order number uno. We're trying to get our pockets fat like sumo. It's on Bungie. The pickup location is Florin Decor. We're gonna drive 41.27 miles. We're picking up 390 pounds of Florin and we'll receive a payment of 71.79. We ain't stopping until we shine, let's go. Just like that, we are here at Florin Decor. Get to this money we would never ignore. Hello, how you doing? Good. Um, I have a, a pickup uh, on the Bungie app for Hugo Soto. They just picked that up. Them? From Bungie. The same order? Mm -hmm. It literally just left, not even five Right here? Ago. Uh, yeah, the white uh, no. So this one, uh, no, the Asian guy, mm -hmm. was used with Bungie. Yeah, the uh, six boxes of hardware. Yeah. Yep, he left already. Same stuff. His name was Juan? He had long hair? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's Juan. I know him. Yeah. He what? Got it already. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, he just left, not even five minutes ago. Yeah, we just loaded him up. Well, thank you guys very much. I appreciate it. So, as you guys can see, they just gave another person an order. So, I don't know if Bungie double booked or if the, 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 uh, the store did something wrong. I'm not sure which one happened. So, I reached out to Bungie and said this. I got to the pickup location and they said they just gave the order to another driver. They said, hello, who did you speak with? I said, Jackie. They said, okay, so this order needs to be canceled with a question mark. I said, yes. How much will I be compensated? They said a $20 cancellation credit will be added in and you will see it on tomorrow's disbursement. I said, I had a huge problem with that. So I said, so I drove all the way here and I'm only going to receive a $20 cancellation fee because you guys double booked the order. They said, we didn't double book the order. The store scheduled this. Our standard cancellation is $20. I said, okay, is that before or after you arrive at the store? They said, it is just our standard cancellation policy in general. You can email driver at bungee.com for further details. So pretty much, they, they, and they said, well, they don't want to talk to me no more. Pretty much is what they said is they do not want to talk to me no more. But I'm going to show you guys how God works. So, so a little bit later on, right after I get home, another order come in on Bungie. I'm talking about this was another order. Now, I kind of did not want to do this order. I'm going to tell you guys the honest truth. I didn't want to do this order because we had to be back at Florin Decor at 5 p.m. And we had to drop off the order by 5 p.m. 45 p.m. to 7:45 p.m. So we were gonna run into traffic, traffic, looking for my chapstick. So I decided, you know what? I'm gonna take the order. Now, this is what the order was. The order said it was two pallets, right? So one pallet was $103 and some change, and the other order was $103 and some change. Each pallet was supposed to have 75 boxes of florin. So we were supposed to pick up a hundred and 50 boxes of florin and we'll receive a payment of $206 and some change. So guess what? I accepted both orders so we can go out there and do our thing and we, uh, it's time to pull up and get this change. Let's go. And we are back again. Clap again. We back at Florin Decor for the second time. We are here on the grind to the end of time. Hopefully it let us shine this time, baby. Hopefully it let us shine this time. For last time it was ugly. Yes, ma'am. A bungee pickup for Brett. Yeah. Appreciate you, boss. Uh, and 
just like that, it's time to hit the road and get our pockets on swole. Let's go! And just like that, we are here at the drop-off location. To be honest with you guys, I don't think nobody is here. I think they bought this house and they're remodeling it, but I don't see any signs of anyone being here. Guess what else? I called and texted the customer. They never answered or never replied, so I don't know. But guess what? We're gonna do it. We're gonna skull. <laughs> we are going to skull. Well, guys, guess what? The customer has not answered the phone. I texted and called him three times. I texted and called him before we left the store. Then when we got here, I texted and called him again. Knocked on the door, no answer. I reached out to Bunyan to let them know what was going on. They asked me that I had this number and it was the wrong number. On the app, they gave me the wrong number. So I texted and called that number two times and they still did not answer. So, uh, guess what, baby? This, my friend, is going back to the skull. About to pull up, get dough, and skull, let's go. You guys will not believe this, baby. You guys will not believe this. So we're driving here and guess what? This joint is closed. I looked it up and it's actually closed. I thought it closed at eight, but it don't look. <clears throat> Monday through Friday, seven to 7 p.m. Y'all wanna see what time it is? I'm gonna show y'all right now. It is 7.29. Guess what? I don't know what's gonna happen now, but we are about to reach out to Bungie and see what's gonna happen, baby. We, hey, y'all got to pay us an overnight storage fee. Y'all got to pay us an overnight storage fee. It ain't, my, it ain't my fault. So we're gonna see what's gonna happen, baby. Let's go. You guys just saw what happened, baby. We went to the store and the store was closed. So at this point, I have no idea what to do. I mean, you could try to call Floor and Decor all you want to, but they're not gonna answer because they're closed. So I decided to reach out to Bungie and I told them this, the store is closed. What do I do now? They said, oh no, Jerome. Is this your last delivery? I said this, it has to be now. I can't fit anything else in here with these boxes of flooring. They said, do you think you can keep them overnight and take them to the store tomorrow morning? There will be a compensation for this. Now, previously, when I asked them about the compensation for dropping the floor back off to the store, they said they didn't know. They did say that we would receive a full payment for picking it up and trying to drop it off to the customer's house and we will also receive a additional payment for the return so we're gonna earn some of that money now i said i have a scheduled route on tuesday that puts me in a very tough predicament i need to know exactly what my full compensation is going to be because before they said they didn't know how much it was going to be so now at this point i need to know exactly what it's going to be before i keep this floor overnight because i ain't got time to play no games i need to know how much change we are going to get they said we will add a hundred and forty four dollars for the return and a hundred dollars for overnight stay so me and my business partner talked about this we decided that we trying to get some more money i'm telling you guys this right now while you're dealing with these different apps try to negotiate everything is not set in stone they might try to just give you anything you might just take it so try to negotiate so what we decided to do is ask them for five hundred dollars we want five hundred for this they like, no, we got 450 for you. So like, look, man, look. So what's gonna happen if we don't keep it overnight? What y'all gonna do then? Like, if you don't wanna keep it overnight, you can stack everything up neatly by the store and leave it by the door, hey. And this money you ignore. So I'm like, I don't know, man. So we go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, plenty of times. I'm talking about plenty of times. I was, we was really trying to get this money. We was really trying to get that $500 because honestly, the power is in our hands for us to get these bands because they need us, we don't need them. At this point, we already made a good amount of money, but y'all want us to hold everything overnight, which is gonna inconvenience us for tomorrow when we gotta do our other route. So let us get 500. They was like, man, we can't do it, man. The maximum we got is $450. So what I'm guesstimating is, I'm thinking that the customer paid $450 for this order and they just breaking even and they're gonna have to charge them again later on and get their money on the back end. But guess what? We got to pull back up to floor decor and get it in and get these dividends and win. Let's go. And we are back the next day. How you guys doing? 
I'm living the dream, I can't complain. See if they're gonna get us right, Ski, so we can get busy. They gotta come get these drinks off the van so we can get these bands, you understand? How you doing, boss? I'm gonna have a drop off for you guys. I had a delivery yesterday and the customer was not there. It was, it was a bungee order. And then when I came back last night, it was closed. So it's you like, were closed? yeah, you guys were closed. Yeah. And what is it? It's still, it's like 75 boxes of flooring. It was supposed to go out there to Brookfield, to a house out there in Brookfield. Mm -hmm. I went out there, the order was at 5 p.m. I went out there, the customer went there. I called them, called them, called them, they didn't answer. I reached out to Bungie, they told me to bring it back here. And then when I got here, it was 7.30, so you guys were closed already. Seven. Yeah. Okay, so... The van right here. Yes, sir. Just like that, it's over with, baby. But when our thing got busy, I'm glad you guys are with me. We moved kind of swiftly, more thing, R.I.P. Nipsey. So, for those two orders, it was very easy. We didn't have to unload anything. We went out there and got busy, didn't we? Comment below and let me know if you think we got busy or not. Altogether, we made $470.74, enough money to pay the rent. We got the $20 for the cancellation fee, and then we got $450.74 for that return trip off the rip. Shout out to Lil Flip. Guess what? The game is over. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, do me a favor. If you are not subscribed, make sure you smash the subscribe button. We're also going to start posting some shorts and stuff like that. So make sure you guys watch the shorts and also make sure you guys are hitting the like button, baby, to push us up on the YouTube algorithm. Because guess what? The views and everything has been very low and we, ain't, we barely been getting any dough, baby. We barely been out there scoring. Hey, this money, please don't stop ignoring. I'll see you guys on the next one. We go, we go, we flowing. You already know it. It's DDK and I'm on my way.